It's Dominique and I'm going to show you today how to decrease your sock to make the toe. I apologize this has taken me far too long, like over seven months, to show you this. It's super easy. There's different techniques for the toe, um, but this one is the easiest and the easiest to remember. So, when you've determined how long um, you want your sock to be for the foot, I recommend going um, knitting up to the length of the foot right where the crease is for your toes start. That's where I would start decreasing. If they're a little bit big, you can always wear sports socks underneath them in the winter time to keep them warm. So you're going to knit two together and then knit the remaining stitches on the needle. And just do this for each needle going all the way around until you are down to four stitches in total. So once again, knit two together. My needle's being picky. So is my yarn. Okay. Yep. Yeah. So, knit two stitches together and knit the remaining on the needle. Repeat that going all the way around and this will decrease the amount of socks, or sorry, the amount of stitches on your sock. And when you're down to four stitches, in total, one on each needle, you're just going to cut off a good length of yarn, take a darning needle or a sewing needle and pull the yarn through the four loops and tuck it inside and make a small knot so it doesn't come out. And that is how you make the toe of the sock. And there's different ways. This, um, this technique will give you a pointier kind of toe, um, the point being in the center of the toe. And then there's square toes, there's more rounded off toes. Just follow what your pattern says. But this is by far the easiest one that I know of. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day.